Hi guys, this is Vineet and in this video we will talk about how you can do point in time restores in SQL Server. Before we proceed ahead, I would request you guys to please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and hit on the bell icon to get all the notifications. And now let's come back to the topic which is point in time restores in SQL Server. So let me quickly check you to my notes so we will cover this topic we will do this demo how to do point in time restores in sql server so let's open up sql server management studio waiting for it to open all right uh, sql server is about to open so let's see so once this is open now this is opened up let's connect to it and so in the list of databases we have uh, various databases so I will I have a backup of Northwind database a full database backup of Northwind database using that we will perform point and time restore so we will select the restore database option from the right click context menu of the databases need to select a device and we need to select the location where, where our database backup file is if you don't know how to take backups please uh, refer to my earlier videos uh, they show you how you can take various kind of backups so right now this is a full database backup file containing the full database backup so you can check the contents right now it's not showing up anything over here let me check now yeah it has a full database backup so it's a full database backup so we will try to restore this and there's a timeline option where you can define the timeline uh, you can set a point in time where you want to restore the database so we the last backup the full database backup was last taken at this point so we cannot restore it anything earlier than that so using backup option and specific date time can be the same uh, at this point so in case we have multiple backups we could have stored it to an earlier point in time but yeah here we cannot do much so for example if I try to restore it to 120 it will not show us anything that you, you can uh, restore a backup maybe let's see if uh, database option gives us the option to restore a point in time so we we have a full database option but yeah th this we don't have let's see if timeline can be used for a specific date and time so this is a full database backup and it was taken on 10 10 and there's a log backup which is automatically taken at 16 4 4 59 p.m. so let's see if a point in time restore is possible so it's showing me a transaction log backup is available and earlier we had a full backup on 10th so if we go device we cannot go earlier than that so this is the date when we took the full backup so this is the date which is 10 10 1 39 49 pm after that we have a transaction log backup so we cannot restore prior to this point the full backup was taken but yeah we can restore it to the point after that because our automatic transaction log backup is available to us so so for example if I, if I want to restore it at 18 so I need to drag a slider so I want to restore at this point specifically 18 I can set it specifically over here I want to restore it at uh, 6 p.m maybe on the same day I can restore it but let's see how far I I have the option so why I want to restore it till today maybe uh, right now it's 5 30 I want to restore it till 5 p.m. so I can select the option over here 5 p.m. let's see if we have availability yeah we have the availability till but it has not okay here I've defined the 5 p.m. so yeah it can restore it till 5 p.m. transaction log backup was available till 4.59 but yeah it's taking till 5 so yeah we can restore it 
at that point. But yeah, we can specify earlier time as well. Let's restore it to 4 p.m. That can be done as well. So this will restore it at the status at 4 p.m. All right, and timeline shows various kind of database backups we have available on the timeline, so you can restore accordingly. We are restoring it till this point, which is 4 p.m. So let's do OK and click OK again to do a restore. So this is how a point in time restore can be done. Here we restore it to today's date at uh, 4 p.m. Up to 4 p.m. we have restored it. The status is on 4 p.m. So this is how it is done. Uh, so guys, uh, I hope you really like this video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. Click on the bell icon to get the regular notifications regarding my future videos. And please do share with this video with your friends. And do share your comments with us. We would love to hear about us. Uh, and hear about you as well and uh, do let us know if you want uh, videos on any specific topics that we can make we would love to do that uh, we thank you once again so much for your time on this video today and you have a wonderful day ahead